Hello everyone, Apple has dropped iOS 26.2 beta 1 today. Yes, I know that's surprising because even I did not really expect this coming today. I was thinking that they will probably go ahead with 26.1 release and just give it some time and then release 26.2. I did thought that they might as well release the 26.2 beta 1 today, but alongside the 26.1 public release and all. But Apple decided to drop iOS 26.2. 6.2 beta 1 today it is here and finally it seems better than earlier let's talk about it this is jay aka tech hype let's get right in today's video without wasting any more time okay so first of all do not really expect right now to get a lot of new changes or a lot of crazy features coming up because right now i use 26 the only thing i use 26 desperately needs is refinement refinement and refinement because especially older iphones are suffering a lot battery drain is so crazy there are so many animations bugs liquid glass is cool and all but it is very buggy in a lot of areas so many animations are so buggy and everything is just not the best and how it should be i use 26.2 improves upon everything and it feels more fluid to use and more slicker compared to earlier like it's just been barely an hour that i have been using it on my device so i can't really comment a lot in terms of anything as such but uh, yeah uh the my first impressions are that it definitely feels more slicker to use and animations and everything feels a bit more faster and snappy compared to earlier and that's really cool because uh, during like after you install a beta update it takes some time to settle down and all but this update is surprisingly quick that it's just been an hour and i just installed it and it's really snappy do let me know down in comments below are you installing the beta update of ios 26.2 or not probably not because i would not recommend anyone installing a beta update right now keeping in mind that there is no as such new feature or big changes here going on at least to me i have been trying to find some new features and changes but i don't really see any big changes as such the only good things that i see is snappier performance and some bug fixes like the wi-fi drop bug seems to be resolved now and the settings icon and battery graph seems to be more bigger now and it looks a bit more bolder like compared to earlier it's a very minor difference but yeah it is there liquid glass animation also seems a bit more darker like the liquid glass effect seems a bit more bold compared to earlier that's pretty much it for today's quick little episode i will be coming up with a bigger video when i happen to find some new more hidden changes and hidden features in this update so make sure to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already Already. Peace out and have a great day everyone.